Uh, call this meeting of Ohio County Fiscal Court to order uh, on this 15th day of January at 5 p.m. Uh, I want to ask Jason Bullock if he would lead our uh, prayer and place the flag. Bow your heads, please. Dear Lord, we just love you so much. Uh, we ask that uh, you be with these uh, new, 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 newly elected magistrates, dear Lord, as we start a new term. Uh, even though we've been here, we just ask that you be with us and that everything we uh, talk about, that we pray about it and that we look over it and we ask you for, uh, for advice and making the best decision for Ohio County, dear Lord. We just pray for this county. We pray for the people in it. We ask that you keep them safe. We ask for growth and prosperity, dear Lord. Again, thank you for all the blessings you've given us in your life. And it's your name we pray. Amen. Amen. Pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. <laughs> Uh, before you you have the minutes of the January 7th special call meeting do I have a motion to approve those <coughs> motion by Larry Morphew second by Larry Count is there any discussion corrections or additions being none all in favor say aye aye, aye. Opposed, like sign. Motion carries. Uh, you'll have the uh, uh, bills, claims, and payments and transfers before you. Uh, I need a motion to approve those. Make a motion to approve. Motion by Jason Bullock. Second. Second by Larry Morphew. Is there any discussion? Any discussion? Being none, all in favor say aye. Uh -huh. Opposed, uh -huh. like sign. The bills are, are approved. Um, we are going to, Sam Small is going to be a few minutes late. And he's the, uh, he is coming. And, and he is the uh, OCDA, uh, the fiscal court's representative on OCDA. And since the next item, uh, uh, he should be here. We're going to move down and we'll come back to this. Uh, so now we have the Treasurer's December report. Any questions on that? Make a motion to acknowledge. Motion to acknowledge by Joe Barnes. Second. Second by Larry Count. Any discussion? Or questions for Ann? <coughs> Being none, all in favor say aye. 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 Opposed, like sign. Most curious. Do uh, you have the clerk's quarterly report? <coughs> so we'll do now. Motion by Larry Count to acknowledge the receipt. Second. Second by Joe Barnes. Uh, are there any discussion or questions for uh, Bess? Being none, all in favor say aye. Uh, opposed like sign that motion carries the clerk's 2019 estimated fee budget uh, do I have a motion to acknowledge that we got it so, motion, motion, motion for Larry Cam second. second with Jason Bullock I'm going too fast. No. Uh, is there any discussion or questions for uh Bess on that one. That was the fee budget? Yep. That's yes. Right, yeah. uh, any questions or uh, discussion? Being none, all in favor say aye. Uh, Opposed, like sign. That motion carries. Now then, does anybody here from the sheriff's office? Okay. Do you, you, so uh, do we have those reports up here for the sheriff's office? Yeah, right here. Okay. Okay. Uh, the sheriff's fee account quarterly report. I'll make the knowledge. I'll make the motion that we acknowledge. Or just motion by Jason Bullock Second. to acknowledge it. Second by Larry Morphew. 
Is there uh, any discussion or questions? Being none, all in favor say aye. Aye. Opposed, like sign. That motion carries. <coughs> Next, you have the sheriff's estimated fee budget. I'll make the motion. We also accept. The no, so we got that. Okay, Jason Bullock, I'm second by by who second? Joe yeah. Joe Barnes. Yeah. Jason Bullock and Joe Barnes um, to acknowledge that we got that. Is there any questions or discussion about that? Yeah. <laughs> okay. No discussion. All in favor say aye. Aye. Uh -huh. like sign. Motion carries. Uh, next, we have a. Uh, go ahead and give me the personal thing. The original one, not the other one, right? The one from the meal driver. I have a change here to put up for a, a, a substitute meal driver, which means they only work when another one is out. And Brenda's brought Brenda Kessinger, 938 an hour. This is only when someone else is out. Uh, so just you have to roll call that. Bullock? Yes. Barnes? Yes. Johnston? Yes. Count? Yes. Morkew? Yes. There you go. Uh, Justin has asked for a short, right, Justin? He will be short. Short closed session concerning uh, is it acquisition and... Uh, Litigation, is that right? B and F. Yes. Yes. So moved. Motion below Cam. Second. Second with Jason Bullock. Uh, we're back into open sessions. Okay. I will say for the record for anybody that's uh Interested? Uh, no business, no motions were made in this meeting. Uh, we discussed a few things, but uh, in there, on some of them, motions will be made tonight, and some maybe not. But we uh, we did uh, we discussed what we was allowed to in in uh, closed session. But from that, we have a couple motions. Uh, Justin, uh, in, if you can't get this one, he'll give it to you later. Justin's going to tell us what the motion needs to say. Then, when you guys can make it. Okay, just a little explanation. Um, a William Ferris purchased property east of Meadow Road, which is out by the landfill uh, here recently. And when he had his property surveyed, um, it was discovered that the county owned a portion of that eastern, of, 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 of an eastern track of land, of a track of land east of Miller Road in which he had built an existing driver and the drive was there prior to his purchase. Uh, and that was not the understanding of everybody as far as who, who they believed owned it. But when he had it surveyed, it was also discovered that on the west side of Miller Road, which the county believed it owned, there was three, approximately three some odd acres uh, that the county believed they owned that Mr. Ferris had purchased through, through D. He's willing to exchange the three and a half some odd acres for 1.64 acres. That would allow us to have everything west of Miller Road and he east of Miller Road. Um, and uh, you know, I think the court is, is uh, would trade 1.64 acres for 3.5 acres just about any day. So we'd make the motion. I would recommend that you make the motion to approve the transfer of approximately 1.64 acres east of Miller Road to William Ferris in exchange for the three point, um, let's just say approximately 3.5 acres west of Miller Road and I'll permit uh, uh, David Johnson and to execute the deed along with Ann Melton to attest same. I'll make that motion. Motion with Joe Barnes. I'll second the motion. Second with Jason Bullock. Any further discussion? And by the way, if any other anybody else wants us to trade trade us three acres for one, we're up. We're we're interested. So a little bit of humor there. Uh, I guess if if just go ahead and roll call that. Mm -hmm. 
Bullock. Yes. Barnes. Yes. Johnston. Yes. Count. Yes. Morphew. Yes. Small. Yes. Okay, we're going to go back onto our schedule now because Sam is here. Uh, Chase, uh, won't you come up and explain to us about this uh, loan uh, application? Good evening. It's been a while since I've come before you with a loan request, but uh, we have one in hand tonight. At our last OCEDA board meeting, the OCEDA board uh, unanimous, uh, unanimously approved a loan to Uncrafted Territory LLC in the amount of $40,000, and I come before you seeking your final approval. Uh, Uncrafted Territory LLC is owned by Brett Morphew, who's uh, to my rear here tonight with us. Um, and he has purchased some property in downtown Beaver Dam for the purpose of operating a microbrewery there. Uh, he's put in, uh, at this point, uh, close to $30,000 of his own money. Also has uh, $20,000 in equity from a silent partner who will not be uh, named in the LLC. And uh, we're partnering with Limestone Bank to, to make this project happen. It's about a $100,000 project to complete. Uh, Limestone will be uh, issuing 40 in hopes that we also issue 40 uh, to cover the re rest of the renovations and also all the micro brewing equipment uh, to get them up and running. We think that this is going to be a great product or a great uh, uh, place of business for the city of Beaver Dam and help the county with all of our tourism efforts and, and the growing momentum with uh, downtown development and shows at the Beaver Dam Amphitheater. So uh, that's pretty much the details. Uh, we, uh, well, as far as collateral, we will be taking a second to limestone on the commercial property itself. Uh, we had it, or they had it appraised for its value as of uh, renovation completion and it, the renovation uh, appraisal came back at 125,000. So that would be more than enough to cover uh, all the debt that would be on that uh, location with us and limestone together. And that coupled with the uh, first position that we would have on all equipment and chattel inside of the building and also the personal guarantees of the uh, owners of the LLC. Uh, like I said, the, the OCEDA board uh, unanimously and enthusiastically approved this at their last meeting and, and come before you for final approval and be happy to answer any questions that you have. Okay, but first we need a motion. Sam? I'll make a motion. I'll second. Second with Jason Bullock. Now we're open for discussion. Anybody have questions for uh, Chase or the uh, the owners are here? You have questions for them, anybody? We also have a few members of the OCEDA board here tonight if you have any questions. Yes, go ahead, go ahead and introduce them. Why don't you? We have uh, C.C. Robinson who represents uh, Ohio County Hospital and our greater health care community. Darren Lutchell, who represents the agricultural community in the county, and also uh, Kenny Autry, our chairman. Okay. Uh, any more discussion or questions, gentlemen? Being none, go ahead and roll call it, Miranda. Make sure I'm all the to write a check. I'll include that. Yeah. I'll put that in there, Miranda. Block? Yes. Barnes? Yes. Johnson? Yes. Cown? Yes. Morphew? Yes. Small. Yes. Thank you. Well, the motion carries. Congratulations, folks. And good I luck. article in the Sunday paper, too. I saw that. Yeah. In and a good, good luck on everything. Thank you very much. <coughs> uh, we're moving right on into committees. Uh, I don't think any committees have met since our last meeting, but I will encourage you to do so. Uh, and, Larry, do you want a road committee at, before the next... Uh, Next uh, court meeting at let four o'clock. Um, yeah, we need to. We, we probably next since we're just having one meeting a month. We probably ought to have one every month. Every time. Make it a habit. To have okay. One. Four o'clock. An hour. Four o'clock. To the uh, yeah. regular court meeting. We can do. Yeah. Does okay. Keith just give us some information on the spray truck. You know what a new one would be. Yeah. It'd be good to go over that in the. Good. In the committee first, did you say, Joe? Does it be better to go over that in the committee first, did you say? I think it would just, you know, go through all these details and yeah. make sure. I think that would be good. I think it will make a substantial difference the, uh, after you check the Note that we're going to have. No, this is a spray oh, truck for the yeah. weeds. Oh, okay. But still, but you're right on the other part, too. You know, we, need oh, okay. to, we need to discuss that at our next meeting where we get a truck with some type of sprayer to spray over the top of it. We do. We have it. Yeah. We've already purchased it. We used it some. 
Yeah. But we didn't use it con all the time like we should have. Yeah. It never made it to the fourth. <laughs> <laughs> well, the turn signal for that side of the track don't work yet, but we'll we'll work See on. If you can work on those signals that'll turn forward forward through. Uh, no, no, we will. We'll get some of them done. <laughs> yeah, uh, they were so surprised in Fordville to see that much equipment. I mean, they're having a celebration night. I hate to, I hate yeah. to miss it, but I knew we had. To well, now, I got several calls today because there's some stuff in mind. They were wondering what's going on. I had some stuff in mind. <laughs> Yeah. On the uh, on committees here, I'm going to make a few additions and, and uh, a new, new appointments tonight. Uh, I want to add Josh Wright to the Gas and Oil Committee because we don't have an employee on there, and I think it's important to have an employee on every committee, so uh, that's somebody I can call and insist to meet and all that stuff. Uh, and, uh, and fortunately, one man's here tonight, Pat Gibson, Givens, Pat, Gibbons, Charlie said that the other day. Pat Givens is the new president of the uh, Firefighter Association. He also is the chief of Rockport Department. So we're glad to have you here, and we're going to honor you by giving you a committee assignment. You will re you will represent the uh, Firefighter Association on the Fires Due Committee, and uh, Charlie, you'd see that it meets within the next month. Um, the rest of them are pretty much the same, but I would uh, the uh, jail committee. Um, Charlie, you're you're the county employee on that too, so you can see it meets within the next month. Uh, one up. Uh, I'm not changing them, but uh, there is a county employee on there that I'll contact. Ken, Kenny, you can do that. See that that committee meets within the next month. The jail? No, that one up. Oh, the one up. Yeah, I'll, I'll fill you in on it. The last time you came up, all we came up with was uh, uh, incentive for people that went to, took college courses. But I envision it being broader than that. We need to look at that. Trying to get our county employees to improve themselves. Uh, the rural maintenance committee will be as as stands. But Charlie, you need to see that meets within the next month. Uh, Jerusalem Ridge Committee does meet, but they haven't officially given a report to the court in a long time. So let's have a report from, from this committee in uh, February, okay? Guys that are on it. Actually, you are, Jason. Three, uh, three, there's three masters on that right now. Uh, I will be adding a county, uh, county employee, but I don't have them right now. Uh, Oh, yeah. Finance committee is his stance. I'm not making any changes on it. Admin code committee. Uh, we're changing it a little bit, and I will send everybody out a notification that's on it because we're still in the process of, uh, of thinking it right now. Uh, we're actually going to make it a little bit smaller, or, or as we say, meaner and leaner. Uh, We'll appoint a road plan committee, uh, and this is, to, is of course, a committee that we hope is going to come back with a road plan to present to the court sometime within the first six months of this year. And uh, there's going to take a lot of logistics and things like that too. That's why uh, putting Bo Wright on that committee, he he represents his own grad, and we'll make sure that we get all the expertise from grad available for mapping and questions and anything like that and somebody from grad will attend the first meeting of the of this uh, committee um, of course Keith automatically is on it Joe Barnes I'm, I'm signing him to it uh, and and that's going to get us started and we may add others we go once we get hold to grad to see how much this they're going to do for us but you guys, when you meet first time, you basically the first report you give is the formula. How we're going to use to do it, we'll come up with with the formula to to devise the plan by, and then Grad will help us with identifying where everything is that needs to be done, the mapping, and all those sorts of things. And the goal is to have it to present to you guys for. I uh, give you a motion to pass this by first of July. Second. 
Are there any examples out there? That those <laughs> yes, we can get them from other counties that have them. Judge, I'm fine with serving on it, but I, I mean, we can get started, but I'd recommend having more than one magistrate on there. Being, um, a, being our districts are kind of <laughs> represented different. Of course, ultimately, they're all going to be on it. Okay. Ultim ultimately, it'll come back to, to the road uh, the road committee. Okay. And then from there, uh, property owners protection. Uh, all of this other committee, the rural maintenance committee, will be on it. And also, I'm looking to add, I would like Justin to serve on that. I believe he said he would. Okay. You don't remember that? Yep. Okay. Okay. Uh, and uh, and I'm going to ask. I'm going to find a real estate agent to go on there at some point. And one real estate agent. Mm -hmm. uh, so anyhow, that's that's coming down. Real estate agent. There is a jail committee in place. Uh, do you call Rip tomorrow and tell him they need to meet sometime within the next month? Okay. But we, we're not making changes on it, but they do need And rural maintenance and Jerusalem Bridge. Got it. Yes, yeah. That would be a good start. If, do you know what I mean by, what I mean by a, uh, uh, com a protection, property communication, owner's Protection. Mm -hmm. What I mean is lights, planning, and zoning, or light planning. I mean, he's, he's just not yeah, not over the board, but something to protect property owners from having having uh, not being able to, to enjoy their property by something that might go bad. That's what that means. Is that, oh, uh, you're talking basically like trash and protection. That no, way. no, a little further than that. Okay. In other words, we need some planning in the county about what can go next to what well, it's, else. It's along with planning and zoning, kind of like that. Sort of. Okay. Sort of, but not ridiculous like our neighboring counties have. Yeah. Or not nearly as intense as what the cities have. Um, um, if any other committee reports, being none, let's move right on. Uh, Sam. I uh, just want to apologize for being late tonight, uh, but that's all I have. Okay. Joe? Yeah, we've got a motion here about a county truck that we was purchasing. Yes, sir. The motion, I'd like to state, 2000, in 2018, Ohio County Physical Court uh, advertised for bids on two different trucks, specified as a half ton and a three quarter ton. As both trucks were, as both trucks, there was only one bidder received, and it was from the same bidder. And the physical court accepted the smaller truck. However, the court has now realized that this truck will not meet the needs for the of the county because what when we move them down to other departments. So we'd like to change that half ton truck into and. Uh, Rescind that bid and accept the three-quarter ton truck. And just so we we know, we've already talked to the uh, um, the bidder, and they've accepted to do that. And there was only one bidder, and they bid both trucks. So it should be not shouldn't be any kind of problems there legally. And for Ann to write the check when it comes in. Okay. Can you hand that to her so she'll make sure she gets it? Yeah. Man, try. The, I don't have the price on the half ton. Well, she's the price on the three quarter ton in. was thirty five thousand. She can add that if you don't mind. She can add that to it. Uh, do I hear a second? I sure already have the half ton. Second. Second. second by Larry Camp. Any further discussion? And just so the public knows, I know that's a lot there in that motion, but we was. We was looking at going with three quarter tons. We accepted bids, and that was done a little while ago. And then we revisited it, and that time the bids come in as a half ton, just as a we were looking at just getting three quarter tons from now on to go to the other departments because uh, it's better used in 
like our departments like parks and the road department more usable snow plows and everything and so we decided to back up on that and even in our litter abatement uh, we've actually bought that skid steer that we just got and the half ton won't pull that skid steer so we wanted to make change before we ended up with something that wasn't as good okay um, all in favor say aye aye opposed like sign motion carries okay, anything else Joe no that's it uh, Larry Larry no Justin no thank you has anybody in the general public got anything for the good of the body and does Yes, go ahead. Is there going to be a fifth Tuesday meeting? No. There is a fifth I'm, I'm glad you asked, though. <coughs> now, we're going to uh, go to the, if this is okay with you gentlemen, and did the formula, Tuesday. and it works much better if we go one a month on the second Tuesday, then there will be five special calls during the year that will go in and we'll go to each district. And uh, I'm going to, next meeting, I'm going to have one of these with some numbers in them. Y'all can draw and see who gets it first. And then you will decide where it goes unless you want me to and I will. Do you is, it going to be, motion? is it going to be on the second we'll Tuesday or one. third Tuesday? Second. We already did it. Second Tuesday. Second Tuesday of every month. Yeah. Okay. I, I, I recall that but uh, Rosine I thought we said the, I did. the third. We said the third. I did. Yeah. Third when she looked at how the bills came in, how yeah, the months laid out, with one meeting it worked much better on the second. Okay. Yeah. Uh, on record. So, uh, okay, Ann. That was one of them. The other one is just to let you all know that the property that was bought at the park five, six years ago is now paid off. So that debt has been retired. Thank you. It, it was actually 12 years ago, but that's fine. It's been here longer than I thought. The road department bill? <laughs> is that the one in question? No, the park land. Oh, the land. The extra land that is. Uh -huh. Huh. That's it? Yeah. Huh? We'll say pay a year of year. Uh, how much was the payment a year that we've eliminated? It was about twenty-five thousand. About twenty-five thousand yeah. a year. And we only budgeted for half a year in this fiscal year, so we won't have to budget that next year. So that's good. We want to. That's one thing we won't have then. Um, do you need that in the form of a motion to change that? Why don't we do it? Just why don't we just go ahead and do that? Yes. Okay. Motion by Larry Morphew. To, to change what? To second Meeting. Tuesday. Oh, to second Tuesday. I'll second. Second with Joe Barnes. Any discussion? Being none, I'm in favor say aye. Aye. Let's change I'm the meeting. Sorry about that. I got the hammer too quick, but uh, I did that my first meeting in grad, too. But I told them it didn't matter. It was already down. I couldn't do nothing about it. Can't take it back. Can't take it back. Uh, with that said, this meeting's adjourned. Hey, guys. When do you.